some penalty area. Moult clears. It's going to come straight back to Astles by the looks of it. So Astles, nice little ball actually by Astles to Benjamin. Benjamin looking for a long range shot. Not a bad one actually. Tony Thompson, I think, saw it a little bit late and uh, pushed it away to Andy White. Pushed it wide of the goal, which is what you're always told to do in these circumstances. Down to our right, he does well in the end, clears it, only as far as Morgan though, not a man to give the ball to if he can help it, Benjamin plays it into the penalty area to Sampson, Sampson back to Benjamin, Benjamin to Astles, Astles might think about a shot again, plays that one in, good ball actually, and laid back by Homsen Smith, Morgan shoots over the bar, goal kick, and with 23 minutes gone and no score, Paul Salt. And uh, we're still waiting for the throw to be taken, it comes down the line, headed back by White. Again headed for the uh, Southport, White to uh, flex the uh, loose ball into Hugh, Hugh to Hancock. Hancock shoots, great shot that. Just tipped over the bar there from Hancock, that was the first real chance of the afternoon. And uh, it was laid back by uh, Hume, back to Hancock. Hancock hit it first time, it looked to be dipping under the bar, but a great effort there. It's uh, going to be taken by uh, Joe Johnson, uh, John Johnson, it's in. Headed then by, uh, could be a chance, a shot again, it was poked forward by Hancock, uh, by Hannigan it was I think, and it's flicked back, Altingham uh, still on the attack, Hannigan heads the ball out to Hume, and uh, Hume has the ball on the, the uh, edge of the area, plays it to Hancock again, Hancock leaves the ball for uh, Richmond, Richmond out to uh, Hume in the left wing position, Hume tries to flick it through, it uh, eventually falls to Harrop, Harrop trying to get round two players, does really well, gets it to Richmond, Richmond, Crossing the middle, that's uh, headed clear by Astles, only as far as White. White gets a push in the back, which they discuss. That's four for all, four against two in uh, Southport's favour, but a good tackle there by White, who got back temporarily halts the uh, blue, oh, sorry, the um, Southport charge of uh, yellow shirts. This time Richmond gets a header out. Altingham almost had a second bite of the cherry from that uh, that corner there, Mark. And Hancock, uh, Hannigan, it was, I think, just couldn't quite force the ball over the line. Uh, the ball's played forward now then Hume is uh, chasing the ball back towards the halfway uh, towards the touchline he picks it up now he's got Johnson in support Johnson cross over to Densmore on the corner of the uh, 18 yard box back to Moult Moult uh, is uh, well that was an attempted uh, shot but it went straight up in the air but Altingham's still in possession it's uh, with Johnson Johnson wins the, the corner there. Uh, 14 minutes to go to half time Again, cross into the near post, takes a deflection, hits the defender. Hume wins it, tries to get space for himself, can't do so. Richmond gets the shot away, though. Great effort there by Simon Richmond, and again for the second time this afternoon, Albinson forced to uh, tip the ball over the bar, but another good effort there. Yeah, very similar, actually, to Josh Hancock's shot, and very similar save. Puts the ball back into the half wing, into the Southport half, but uh, no Altrincham player can... Uh, Get on the end of it, but uh, no, it's Johnson. Johnson looks to run at his man, does well. Ball laid off by Hume, who falls to the ground. Johnson on the overlap. Shot comes in just over the corner of the uh, bar there. It was a good layoff there by Jordan Hume. Johnson went on the overlap, cut inside, and just tried to curl one over the uh, into the top corner of it and just uh, missing out. But uh, Altingham uh, beginning to assert some pressure, Mark. Yes, a lot in the last five or ten minutes. A bit of injury time, I'm sure, because uh, Altrincham have been forced to make two substitutions in this first half. Sean Williams going off in the 16th minute and Andy White in the 27th minute, both uh, as a result of challenges, not uh, particularly malicious challenges, but a uh, good shot comes in by uh, Johnson there, trying to curl it around the keeper inside the uh, left-hand post there, but uh, Alvinson was, was wise to it and uh, able to uh, collect it quite easily. And uh, it was well cut out by Doyle. Doyle played it forward to Sampson. Southport, though, don't clear their lines particularly effectively. James Jones does well. Lays it back to uh, Tom Hannigan. And Hannigan away to the far side to Connor Hampson. Connor Hampson, I thought, had a really good game at Farsley when he got a rare start. So he'll be glad of the opportunity to impress. Hume does well. Gets the ball to Johnston. Johnston tries to pull it back. Drives the final. <laughs> What a goal! What an absolute screamer from John Johnston. Hume played him in down the left-hand side. He fainted to go for the byline. Pulled it back onto his right foot. Bent it into the far top corner. 
Anybody who was at the Cheshire Cup tie at Winsford United two seasons ago, that was the goal that he scored there. And he's done it again here on a more important occasion. Throw to Southport, halfway inside the Ultricube half. Doyle takes it. Heads go up for it. Jones's header not the most convincing. Correa tried to turn and shoots just over the bar. Uh, Correa thinks it was a corner, the referee doesn't. But uh, Altrincham just needs to be careful. That, I won't call it showboating, but uh, that uh, yeah, they're trying to turn on the style now. To be fair, it was with a purpose, as uh, Hancock plays that one down the right-hand side to Harrop. Harrop's got Jordan Hume wide of him. Harrop plays it out to Hume. Hume, chance to get a cross in. Good one! Oh, oh, and slotted into the side netting by Sean Densmore. And another beautiful move by Altrincham, and that was so close to a second goal. Yeah, it was a great uh, crossing from Jordan Hume. He's worked hard this afternoon, right into the path of Densmore. Nobody objects if, if, if referees make consistent decisions, but when, when they clearly make inconsistent decisions like that, that, that really is poor. Hancock picks up the throw-in, tries a shot, dips it onto the top of the net. It was deflected on the way, and Albinson again wasn't saving that one, uh, presumably because of the deflection. That was so close from Josh Hancock. Altrigham have a corner, and this is really good stuff from Altrigham at the moment. So played short. Comes back on to uh, Morgan. Morgan, square ball into the centre of the park to uh, Benjamin. Benjamin playing the ball forward up to uh, the centre forward. He falls over, slips, and uh, shouts from the south port supporters now. And Johnson has a chance to bring the ball over the halfway line. It's two against three. Johnson puts inside, plays a great ball into Hancock. Hancock, can he score? He does! Great ball into Hancock, coming behind the defence. Altman broke with pace there. He's well played by Johnson, put Hancock in. All he had to do was pick his spot. He was able to find the target. And Altman have some uh, clear water now. 2 0 up with 25 minutes gone in the second half. Oh, another superb goal, a very different goal, but a very, very well worked goal. Altrigan broke, I think it was Josh Hancock in the first place who actually won the ball and put John Johnston away. Hancock then overlapped him, Johnston kept his cool, stepped away from the man, played a lovely reverse ball to Hancock. I think the South thought it was going to be, reversed it to Hancock, and Josh Hancock, normal service resumed with his finishing, slotted it away beautifully. That was... Uh... I'm not sure whether he slipped there as he was trying to play the ball there, but uh, it was uh, pretty aimless and uh, collected there by Albinson. And again, it's another ball for uh, Hume. Does well there. This Hume's in now. He's got Johnson in support. Flicks it to Johnson. Can he score? Goes round one man. Puts it in the back of the net. 3-0. And another great work goal there for Altingham. And surely now that is uh, game set and match there. It was the persistence of Jordan Hume that uh, won the ball there. Once he got past the, uh, the defender, then uh, he had Johnson in support, split the ball to Johnson, and Johnson was able to put it in the back of the net, and three great goals, Mark. Another beauty. Yeah, Hume winning the ball superbly, halfway inside the Southport half. Lovely interchange with Johnston. Hume, so cool, just waited until Johnston had run inside him, gave it him on a plate. Johnston just sidestepped the last defender, slotted it into the net. John Johnston's second, Altrigham's third. We did say at the start that once Altrigham started scoring, they might not stop. Goes out left, it's onto the head of uh, Hancock. Hancock does well, flicks it on to Jordan Hume. Hume. Short pass back to Richmond. Richmond back to Hampson. Hampson plays it forward and it's split forward by Malt. The uh, clearance hits uh, Hancock and falls to Hume. Hume now looking to the run of the defence. Ball inside to Densmore. Densmore, good ball forward to Hancock. Hancock goes round his man, gets a cross in. Oh, just behind Johnson there. He's coming in at the edge of the six yard box. Flipped out. Malarkey does well to win the ball. Can't get the second challenge in Southport, bring the ball forward. But Mark Malarkey again gets a second attempt. Richmond back, wins the ball back first for uh, Altingham on the halfway line. Back to Johnson, Johnson all the way back to Tony Thompson, but uh, just for a moment there, it looked as though Johnson was in his hat-trick mark. He did, yeah, he couldn't quite take it in his stride, but a lo lovely move again. Some of the football Altingham have played in the second half would be absolutely wonderful. Richmond with the ball, forward to uh, Hancock, Hancock turns. His uh, challenge comes in there from Woods, but he's able to retain possession with it out to Johnson. Johnson now yet again running inside, gets a shot out just over the bar there. Another great effort by uh, John Johnson looking for his hat trick. But, uh... 
Oh, ball was uh, collected by Malt, flicked on there by Densmore, but just over the head of Richmond allows uh, Marcus Wood to bring the ball forward. But it's a poor pass and well read by Connor Hampson. And there is the final whistle. Support and uh, cheers by the Alton supporters below us. An absolutely fantastic afternoon result wise. And uh, we said at the start of the match that Alton needed to convert their uh, chances, uh, which they squandered at uh, Curzon Ashton on Boxing Day.